hello everyone once again welcome back so in this video i am going to tell you that in which conditions we find the cirrhosis what were the causes of the cirrhosis so let's uh, learn some point about the cirrhosis as this one is the liver in which we see the nodules and in between the nodules there were we find the fibrous septae so nodules divided by fibrous septae and nodules may be of micronodular as well as of macronodular micro means small means less than 3 mm nodules was there well in the macronodular more than 3 mm nodules were seen and in this the there is fibrosis of the stellate cells please remember that fibrosis of stellate cells means collagen type 1 and collagen type 3 involvement is there now the, what were the causes of the cirrhosis for the causes of the cirrhosis we learn this mnemonic that is a b c d e h i w so a b c d e h i w we can not include f and g then h i w so a stands for alcoholic liver disease while in this non-alcoholic liver disease is also involved like cryptogenic cirrhosis which is known as cryptogenic cirrhosis so alcoholic liver disease or autoimmune hepatitis a stands for alcoholic liver disease a stands for autoimmune hepatitis b stands for biliary disease c stands for cryptogenic cirrhosis example non-alcoholic liver disease d for drug induced that is due to which lead to anti-lkm2 antibodies and e for enzyme deficiency like alpha 1 antitrypsin deficiency h for hepatitis we can make i into the h that is hemochromatosis and w stands for wilson's disease so uh, so the causes of the cirrhosis were due to alcoholic liver disease due to non-alcoholic liver disease due to autoimmune hepatitis due to drug induced due to alpha antitrypsin deficiency hepatitis hemochromatosis and wilson's disease so these were the causes of the cirrhosis i hope you get benefit of this video thank you bye bye